my ting. It's not your ting. It's me ting. We ting radio. Boom, boom, boom. Yo, it's your ting. It's my ting. It's we ting. We like me in Trinidad and Tobago. Friends, family, lock it, leave it. We ting. Stay tuned. Nah. Bada da de ke si ya mo se kani, si ya mo se kani. Bada da de ke si ya mo se kani. Hey, this is Hurricane Hema Daniel, and you're listening to Weeting Radio. Big up, man. Greetings. You're listening to DJ to a degree, the maddest DJ on radio. <laughs> anyway, Santana says so. Hey, this is your girl Rich Maramal, aka the Warrior Princess, and you're locked onto Weeting Radio. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's Mystic representing for Weeting Radio, man. Big up the three people and big up Diana, you know. Mystic is a boy representing, bringing the reggae vibe and bringing the little choker vibe as well. Boom! Screw some gold, there's a coolie boy. Me never shame, there's a coolie boy. Why not the thing, there's a coolie boy. Yo, Mystic. Hi, this is Nikki Crosby and it's Weeting Radio. I mean, hello, it's Weeting, so I have to be in it. We. Yo, this is the girl Trudy Ramnai, and you are listening to We Think Radio. Uh huh. Don't feel this thing, then you'll get a man wine and box your waist. Uh huh. Yes, man. It's not my thing, it's not your thing, it's We Think, We Think Radio. Yo, I am Nishan M out of Trinidad and Tobago, and you are locked to We Think Radio. Nothing sweeter than We Think. Love you. The way to the green man shop the dance. They calling him a hooligan, a hooligan, a hooligan. Yo, this is boy Ricardo Drew. It's true, and right now it's all about DJ to a degree. Keep it locked. Lock and load. This is Dre Blunt, the Rockford King. Anytime in a foreign, you know me for lock into a real thing radio. You heard me. Hmm. Yo, 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 it's your boy Ricky Jai. You don't know hit after hit. Bye, man, give me a Guinness and punching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We take radio. That's what you're listening to. I say so. Come on. <laughs> Five years of cultural upliftment. We Ting Radio. Yeah, this is Santana, and you're locked on to We Ting Radio anyway. We Ting Radio! It's not my Ting. It's not your Ting. It's We Ting. We Ting Radio. Boom, 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 yo, it's your thing, it's my thing, it's we thing. We like me in Trinidad and Tobago, friends, family, lock it, leave it, we thing, stay tuned, nah. Oh yeah, we thing radio. Special good morning. Hey, hey, special good evening. Oh, yes, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Good afternoon. Hey, hey, lodge my brother from Guyana. The king of Guyana, you know. Lodge of WRA has only check in. Good night, going out to Malini Sahadeo. Hey, hey. Mousy is you, girl. Good night, darling. Good night, darling. Good night, good night. I hope you're doing well. Apache warrior. Yeah. Good night, brother. Good night. Can I go not to Rosita, right? Tonight is
So here what everybody share the feed. That's right, share the feed, like the page. We got George Singh coming up as the CEO of South Tex. Coming up in just a few. I'm gonna go into these comments in just a few, right? Let me get this thing shared out. All you help me out now. Let me get everybody to share the feed. Large of Andy Sintra. Good night going out to Raj Dew. Yeah, yeah. So as we know, as we know, as we know. Chutney so come on, because the thing that a lot of artists and them look forward to. Large for brother Dave. How we sounding out there, Dave? We sounding good, we sounding nice. Doing okay. Large of Dr. Tunes on the check in. Good night going out to Princess Alicia. Good night going out to the Naidu family. There is Shelly. Good night, Shelly. To my brother Sadar. Salam alaikum. From my brother James, Steve Ramlal, you marry, you marry. Good night, going out to Rizia. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everybody see me and they say we are kidding. 
So large of the Horner man in the building. Frame. I hope you restock with girl, you know. So I tell you, we just shipping. So we got the man, Mr. George Singh, on the line. He's in the backstage. Hey, 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 hey. Like I said, George Singh, the CEO of South Tex, the main man behind the Chutney So Come on up. Coming on in just a couple minutes, right? So share the page. Don't worry about Carnival. Carnival here is now. Let's go, Weeting family. Roger, Pennsylvania. Sweeting Radio. So I bring it on the air right now. The man that's been responsible for a humongous part of our culture going into year 26 now. 
It is never an easy task. I always say this every time I bring them on here to continue bringing new music, inspiring artists in them to get creative every year. And it is unfortunate that the vision that he loves to do every year is going to be hampered this year because I always say this production is a Maroon 5 concert in Trinidad and Tobago for our West Indian culture. And unfortunately, we're going to get into it in just a couple seconds. COVID has totally turned this thing upside down, inside out in regards to the direction that this man does take every year for this tournament. Good night going out to the CEO of Southex, the CEO of Chutney Soka Monarch, the man himself, Mr. George Singh. Good night, Sitaram. How you doing, brother? How you feeling? Good night, good night, Alan. Good, good night, good night to all the listeners, viewers. Um, happy New Year to everyone. Always happy to be on your program, Alan. Um, thank you, thank you. You know, it's happy to be here and to talk about my favorite topic, Chutney Soka Monarch. We only get together once a year, me and you, nah, and it's this that, time of year. <laughs> don't see that, don't see that. We yeah. need to see you in Trinidad, Alan. We need to we, see you in Trinidad. We will, we will, we will. Last year, I helped you behind the scenes. We did the right. first ever um, remote broadcast of the that's Chutney right, Soka Monarch. Right. And, uh, party. Right, with the watch yeah. party. But we went watch magnificent. Correct. Correct. Everybody had a great time. Yeah. And now, you know, George, how do you honestly feel in regards to how COVID is impacting you directly for your 25 years to put on a production has always been something. Now, you're 26. Tell everybody a little bit about so, that. Uh, let me just say this, right? Uh, I know that uh, COVID, as you have said, um, well, in inverted commas, hampered what we're going to do this year. But I don't look at it that way, you know? I think COVID has created an opportunity for us to, to change the... The way Chutney Soka Monarch looks to change the game a little bit. Oh yeah. Um, yes, we are accustomed to doing a, a fantastic production. I want to assure people that what you're going to see um, at the semi-finals and the grand finals is going to be something that is going to look really, really, really good. And, and yes, we've changed the format of the show. Um, it's going to be a pre-recorded show packaged um, and shown on the semi-finals is actually on the 30th of uh, January. Uh, may, you, may, you may have two segments in the semi-finals. Um, okay. so you may have a segment on the 29th and the 30th. All of that information is being worked out right now um, and would be available by Monday. Okay. Um, and then the final is definitely going to be aired on the 13th of February. Have you finalized the amount of people you're putting in the final yet? So and... registration closes tomorrow. Um, right. mm -hmm. um, tomorrow is the last day of registration. What I will tell you is that as of this afternoon we have about 65 people registered wow okay which i was very surprised at because i didn't think we would get to that number in a in a in a, in a pandemic um era mm -hmm. right in a pandemic situation so i want to congratulate the artists for stepping up and really coming out i've had about three or four meetings with them already you know Aaron. Okay. and as a matter of fact i want to say that those zoom meetings that we've been having have actually been more productive than the actual physical meetings when we have them in a physical meeting <laughs> when I have a meeting in my office. A lot of culture. Yeah, you have about 23 people, uh -huh. right? And our Zoom meetings have had about 60 people. Wow, that's great. So, so I mean, it's really been fantastic uh, meeting with the artists. We've had we've had discussions with them. I think we have everybody supporting what we're doing, which is very important. And uh, you know, we're moving forward. Now, last year. You had Chutney Soka Monarch of Canada. This year, Vashti Durga, you've entrusted Vashti since the travel restrictions and whatnot. You was there last year um, to spearhead that project. And one of uh, one of your other co-hosts, uh, co-people in regards to the project is on, W.R. Reyes, who's representing Guyana. He's locked in right now. As you see the comments on the side there. Okay. And then we have uh, my brother Ranjeev is taking care of New York this right. year. It's totally different. How? Uh, what has been the feedback in regards to artists in these different areas, and how are you planning to try to incorporate that? So I wanna, I wanna say hats off tonight to to Vashti Durga, um, W R Reyes out of Guyana, Vashti in Toronto, and Ranji Ramdin in uh, in New in uh, New York. Um, these three people are actually representing uh, Chutney Soka Monarch in their territories. 
and they have been able out of the 65 people that I have told you that are registered, mm -hmm. we have approximately, uh, I'm going to guess this number, but I think it's very close to, I know I had a meeting with them last night, um, close to about 15 people coming from those three territories, which which in a lockdown situation, Alan, is a very, very, very good thing to, a good position to be in. So we have um, the big songs from Guyana are all inside. We have the big players in Toronto inside. And we have the big players in New York inside. So, and we have all the big players in Trinidad. You know, all the big songs. We're going to have an amazing show. The results and the names of the semi finalists are actually going to be announced on Sunday morning at 11 a.m. And I will be joined um, to make that, make, make that announcement by our representatives from all three territories, Vashti, Ranjeev, and Reyes. And they would actually be announcing the names of the qualifying semi-finalists from their territories. So it's, it's something to look forward to. Um, it's going to be live on Facebook. Okay. Uh, and it's that is on Sunday morning at 11 a.m. We're going to make that announcement. So, Alan, your program is the first program we're seeing this on. Nice, so, thank you. Mm -hmm. Right, so so that 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 is definitely coming out tomorrow. Registration closes, and we're looking forward to, to a bumper show. You know, I think we're gonna have a fantastic show. No. We're making the show very similar. It's gonna have a feel like uh, very close to America's Got Talent, but but with our local spin on it, of course. No, right? let me just digress for one second because. Sure. Guyana is making a humongous wave in regards to you're going to have a couple of the powerhouses, guys that have almost 4 million views, two artists that is on the verge of 4 million views. I know Reyes is very proud of what's coming out of uh, Guyana. Look, the, ma the main man, Mr. Avinash Rupchan, just locked in in regards to that. How do you feel this year about the humongous run Guyana is going to give Trinidad and Tobago right now? <laughs> well, you took the words out of my mouth, Alan. And you said it. I think that Guyana is definitely going to give Trinidad a run for their money this year. Um, those songs are huge. And I know they're not only huge in the US and Guyana, but they're huge in Trinidad. And this year is actually the first time. You know, I made this comment when, I, when we had our meeting last night with Riaz, Ranjeev and, and Bashi. This is the first time on the Trinidad and Tobago's Chutney Soka season market that these songs are played in such a big way out of Guyana. I'm very proud of the fact that these, these Guyanese artists have really stepped into the, to, in, into the arena in such a big way. Because, you know, years ago, Alan, I don't know how many people know this, but Guyana had a chutney monarch that they right. used to do. And then I think it might have been in... Uh, 2012. Roger, 2012. Hines, Roger Hines or, some, or someone else. I think it was Roger, right? Yeah, yeah, I think it was 2012. We actually went to Guyana and together with the minister at the time, I um, can't remember his name, um, but anyway, um, he allowed us to do a Chutney Soka Monarch in Guyana. Mm -hmm. And the three winners, I don't know if you remember this, Alan, but we brought the three winners from that show straight to Trinidad. That was the year that KI won with um, Single Forever. So right. it was 2012. Mm -hmm. First right? time. First time. Yeah. And since then, you know, Guyana has continued um, their, their Chutney Soka Monarch. And we're going back into Guyana in a big way as soon as this pandemic is done. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I think I, I've seen the potential. I, I knew the potential was there all the time, but we're really happy to have these artists inside now. And um, are we looking forward to it? I, I'm really excited about these songs. I think that we have, we have some of the best I think we have a crop of songs that, that are probably one of the best crops of songs that I've heard in a long time. And I know a lot of people hear me say that every year, but really and truly this year, uh, I mean, we have, I think people had time during the pandemic to really sit down and write. The lyrical content of, the, of some of these songs are, are quite good. Um, and, you, you know, so so I think that we've made a lot of progress in terms of developing Chutney Soka Monarch. And, and I dare say that Chutney Soka Monarch is probably going to be one of the only, if not the only, carnival competition that takes place this year in Trinidad. Actually, so I'm happy for that. We're flying our flag too. Yeah, we actually, it, yeah, we that is. No, it, no Soka Monarch. Monarch this year. No, no Calypso. Monarch I don't think so. Like I haven't heard anything from from any of those quarters. You know, so um. No, I've been trying to get. I've been trying to get the Guyanese artist them coming in. You know, larger Avinash Rupchan is locked in, and he's did a great job. 
with production and putting, you know, the, the poor song is viral on TikTok, social media. Like I said, uh, are you capping the Guyanese artists like to three or you're just going to go with whatever direction the competition goes? We're just going to go with whatever direction. <clears throat> okay. Excuse me a minute. You want to just grab, you wanna grab something to drink real quick? and <laughs> Yeah, but it, no, I think I'm okay. Okay, all right. We're not capping anybody. <clears throat> so basically, the semi-finalists, people have to qualify. Right. And when they take part in the semi-final, we are only going with 15 artists in the final. Okay. And we're going with the 15 best artists. So I'm not, I'm not guaranteeing anyone that we'll have performers from Toronto, New York or Guyana. I think they have to qualify and that's and that's going to be the beauty of the competition. So once they're in there in the final, you know that they've made <clears throat> they've made the cup. Okay. Now, one of one of the other things that I had touched earlier and it was said since last year prior to the pandemic and whatnot, we know Trinidad was under a kind of recession and whatnot. You felt the brunt of it, especially with the change of government in regards to the amount of prize money that they would allocate for one of the arts program that you fight for every year. Now, what has been that I could imagine has been a huge battle right now in regards for this well, uh, it's 2021. An battle, Alan. It's an mm -hmm. ongoing battle. Um, I did have a conversation with the minister today. Okay. I've had a few conversations with him um we have a meeting with him on tuesday i am confident that we will get some support i i have said to the artists that i cannot guarantee what the prize money will be there will be prize money but it's not going to be anywhere close to what it was last year alan um and i think people should expect that but the most important thing this year is that the show is happening i think that um it's very very important now i say this reservedly but i don't think a chutney soca as an art form or even our local music our caribbean music right um is strong enough to withstand and let me say let me let me say trinidad and tobago's music let, 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 let me just pinpoint it to that for a, mo for a moment soca right. calypso mm -hmm. and chutney soca mm -hmm. i don't think that the music is strong enough to withstand a year with all the competitions because the competitions is a very important part of the whole development of this of this genre of music and the industry I mean, Chutney Soka Monarch has grown the Chutney Soka industry since 1996 to what it is today. And I'm very proud of what it has become. It's been a long road, a long bumpy road. We've had a lot of a lot of hurdles. Um, we've had a lot of criticism, as you would know. Oh yeah, every year. Right? Um, but we've we've stuck. We've, 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 we I've kept my focus uh, as to where where I, I wanted this thing to go, and we have achieved a lot. Um, for Chutney Soka and for Trinidad and Tobago. Now, one of the, the biggest criticism every year is the judging aspect and, and whatnot. How is, since this is virtual, how is the judging going to be done? And is it the same criteria as every year with the, um, well, there's no crowd response. I mean, do, yeah. do, the, the, the category is going to change. The, the criteria has to change a little bit, Alan. Mm -hmm. The criteria will change slightly. Um, the thing is that there will always be criticism of judges, right? And judging, you know, always those who don't win will always feel that they've been cheated, right? So, I mean, judging is something that will always be criticized. However, to answer your question that you asked, right? Um, there will be, because the show is going to be an online TV show, right? And let me explain what I mean by that before I tell you about the judging. So it's going to be shown on CNC3 in Trinidad, national tv okay and we're going to be we're going to have a stream that is going to be available free of charge uh through facebook youtube etc we will post all the links right because there is such a big market of people looking at the show we thought it was important this year to include an element of text to vote so we are including the element of text to vote right so vote there will be a voting element that will represent a percentage of the of the competition right when we meet with artists uh just after the semi-final names are announced we will we will come to an agreement with them as to what that percentage would be i am i am leaning towards 8 to 20 um but i would i would uh, uh, of course put it to the artists and put it to a vote and let them decide 
what percentage they would prefer. On the text right? of voting, you're gonna put that for. Uh... We, we're including that, so there will be judging yeah. elements, and there will be text to vote and text to vote from all over, so USA, Canada, and all through the Caribbean and the region. Right, well, I... anybody will be able to send a text message and vote for their I... favorite artists. Now, I don't mean to cut you. Now, with this, this social media platform, are you looking to incorporate that aspect, comments and likes and shares and stuff like that? Is that something that you're looking at, or? Uh, um, well, I mean, of course, if the if the show is online on Facebook, mm -hmm. people will share it. But we're not doing online. It's not. We're not going to have online voting. Okay. All right. I know that we said that we, we were going to include online voting, but we're not doing online voting. Okay. Strictly mm -hmm. text to vote, right? Um, and and the text people anywhere in the USA, Canada, and the Caribbean region will be able to participate in that text to vote. We actually yeah. had that meeting today. Okay, great. With TSTT. Um, and they are putting things in place for us. I'm hoping that we'll be able to sign off on that by Monday, Tuesday, um, and get those codes out as soon as possible once the names are released, so that we can get everybody's codes to them, so that they can start um, promoting themselves as much as possible. Oh, so you're going to use the text of voting in the semifinals? Is that, that what, yeah, that's what, correct. Wow, okay. Semifinals and final. And that's like 40, 40 artists? Is that what it's you're looking at? About 35. About 35. 30 to 35. Oh, okay. Well, good. That's that's good. I, I mean, at least people are going to be able to get in from that beginning part because usually you do it for the yeah, finals. Yeah, I right. think it's going to make it more exciting, Alan. Yes, it's going to be very interactive. Um, so I think that that element is going to really make it exciting. And, and of course, everybody could participate. So, you know, with, with all these guys and he's involved in the show now and, and, <laughs> and people from the USA and, and Canada and all that, that have their fans all over, people will be able to vote for them. Mm -hmm. Now, who, who are you feeling um, has pretty much done the most in regards to changing their their way how they're coming to CSM this year? Is there anyone that from Trinidad is kind of standing out to you? Anyone from Guyana, from New York? You know, any anything like that? So you see, that's a politically loaded question. <laughs> well, I'll tell you this, right? I, 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 I am liking um, Ricky Jai's song. Family, Family yes, very good friend, song. Right? Mm -hmm. The nine and a half time champion. I know he, he's <laughs> not entering Chutney Soka Monarch this year, unfortunately, uh. right? But I mean, I, I love his song. So the fact that he's not a contestant, I can safely say that I love his song. Very right? diplomatic way to go, nice. <laughs> <laughs> But um, there are a lot of good. There are a lot of good songs. And if, if people that have registered, I mean, we have really heard a lot of good songs. Um, I can safely say that the final fifteen will be a very difficult choice for judges. But the show itself, Alan, is going to be a very interesting show. So, for example, at the semi-final stage, you will get comments from the judges. Mm -hmm. So it will have a feel like America's Got Talent. So you will get comments from the judges. We will have somebody, we'll have a camera backstage doing interviews with artists, telling you where they're from, etc., etc. Right? We'll get side stage um, reactions and all of those kind of things. So we package the show into a red, something that is going to look very different to what people are accustomed to seeing. But it's going to be a beautiful set. And the show itself is going to be done very, it's going to be a very tight show and very well produced so i no. think people can look forward to that um so you know sometimes in chutney so come on when the show is live you have um like I and, and, and i will say this when the when the um reigning chutney so come on gi went on stage he took about 40 minutes to set up right the technical difficulties in you know it was about 30 to 40 minutes to mm -hmm. set up and, and it, 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 it it kills it kills the, the, the vibe inside yeah you know and the momentum especially not necessarily for the people that are in Guaracara Park or Skinner Park or wherever they may be, because they are enjoying the music. But for someone who is looking at it either online or on television, it becomes very dull because what are they looking at? They're looking at nothing. They're looking at people jumping up in a in a um, in, in a in a in a set, mm -hmm. right? Which is no fun to them. So this is going to be a very tightly packaged show that will make that will make it um a lot more enjoyable and user. Uh, viewer friendly, let me say, okay, viewer good. friendly and more palatable to the viewer. So I think that is something to look forward to. And we are actually excited about that particular aspect of putting together a show that is that is that is so tightly put together. 
Now, I know last year you had guest performances, Ravi B, um, Raymond Ramnarine. Raymond's song is one of the, the biggest song this year, yeah. Knock a Ting, that I have playing in the background there. Are you looking at that aspect as Phil is also? Or you we just are definitely keep it... looking at that aspect. Um, okay. um, I'm hoping to have Raymond perform in the final. I haven't even told him that yet, but I have to call him. <laughs> I know if I call Raymond and I ask him that, I, I know he will definitely say yes. Mm -hmm. Raymond is one of our past champions. I know that um, Ravi B is another one that we will look at. So you, they can look forward to performances by by top by top artists, guest performances by by Ravi B, Raymond Ramnarine, guest performances by dance groups. The show itself will have every element that the live show has in Guarakara Park or Skinner Park. So the show that people are custom looking at will be the same show. The only difference being that it is tightly packaged and much nicer to sit and look at um, and, and to a certain extent more enjoyable. Now, and this is one of the things that people look for, the fireworks, the, the theatrics and whatnot. But so that's still a possibility of having these kind of things? No, no fireworks. Okay, no fireworks. We'll be in an indoor venue. Right. So we're not going to have any Sapa. pyrotechnics. Yeah, in South Napa. Yeah, Sapa. Okay. So we're not going to have any fireworks or pyrotechnics. But but listen, when you look at when you look at international shows, right, um, that are put together, whether it is the VMAs or, or whatever, lighting plays a key role. And you know, you can create so many effects with lighting mm -hmm. and make a show look different. You can make a stage look different. Um, dancers will be involved in the show. People will be allowed. We're not allowing props on stage. However, um, anything that a dancer could walk on stage with in their hands and walk off the stage immediately will be allowed. Okay. So what we will, what we will, what we will be, be encouraging is that creativity to come into the show, which we've done in the past and it's been it's been successfully done. So I, I know that um, that the artists themselves would be would, would not be too ha too um, unhappy about that. The other thing you have to bear in mind, um, Alan, um, and your viewers and listeners who are who 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 are, who are looking on is that. Based on the fact that this year the prize money is not going to be that big, one right, mm -hmm. right, and um, the the well that that being the main factor, taking out the pyrotechnics and the fireworks and the and the set building that they, these people come on stage with, eliminates a lot of cost for them. Exactly. We are providing um, all the LED screens on stage. We are providing all the lighting, right, and these will be accessible to the artists at no extra cost. So we, I am, I am trying to make sure that when an artist comes there, that they have very little cost to incur, you know, and they can come and enjoy themselves, put on a show, and at least at the end of the day, we would have done Chutney So Come on, 26, right, in the year of the pandemic, and done it well. Now, that's great. And now, right, before I let you go, I know you have another meeting to go to and stuff like that. Besides the um, prize money, obtaining that and whatnot, what is for 21, what is your biggest hurdle that you're facing right now compared to the years before? Sponsorship. Ah. Mm -hmm. Even though they, so have, the, they have the potential of millions, this. millions let, let of you. viewers. Mm -hmm. let, let me tell you this. Mm -hmm. I'll share this with everybody that's looking on, right? And I said this last night. I don't know if I should say this, right? But up to today, we have not raised one dollar for Chutney So Come On. No, wow. Because people not see they're not seeing the added value that the twenty five years have brought so far. Well, I don't think it's that. I think a lot of people are skeptical about it being the pandemic year. Um the fact that there are not no other competitions going on, the fact that the government has said carnival is cancelled. I think there's a lot of factors working against us. Let me tell but but I, I wanna say that I am very confident, right? We have proposals in front of the government, we have proposals in front of the NLCB, who has been our title sponsor for more than 18 years. Yeah. They haven't confirmed anything yet. But I am confident, Alan, that we will get this done and it and and will happen. Right? Um, if even we have to put up a, 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 a fund me TT link for people <laughs> to help, not, not force people to donate, right. but if people feel that they want to donate and, and they can, right? No problem. But at the end of the day, the show will remain free to the public, right? They can look at it. They can donate if they want. They can not donate, right? But we are going to try and raise the sponsorship to make this happen. The show is happening. Um, the semi-final is on the 30th of January. It will be aired on the 30th. And the final is definitely on the 13th. We have gone through technical meetings with everybody. We have everything down. 
registration closes tomorrow games are going to be announced on sunday so we are moving forward bravely well one thing about you george that people should know by now you're resilient you never take no for an answer you never give up you don't right. ever give you up. find you a way up, you always find a way you're even always and not only that you always follow through with what you believe in you know and i believe that we will get that sponsorship i believe we will get the funding to do chutney soka monarch this year and i am moving forward in all belief that this is going to happen so i don't take no for an answer and i don't let negativity get in my way in, in anything that so, I so what is the motivation factor for you to want to make sure and put this on for 2021 well you know what you know what's the motive alan if i tell you what my motivation fact you see this year last year actually 2020 mm -hmm. was a year i don't think people realize how much artists in particular suffered in 2020. We had artists that were depressed, suffering from anxiety. People didn't have anywhere. No money is coming in. All the gigs that they would do on weekends were oh, canceled. Yeah. Um, and you know, a lot of people have been in conversations with people that would say, well, these guys performing in shows, they're performing in competitions. They make a lot of money over the years. Um, how is it they have no money? If you turn a tap off, Alan, and there's no water in a tap, and you're dipping in a bucket every day, the water in the bucket will finish. You know? And I looked at I looked at what was going on with artists in particular, and my heart went out to them. And I don't know if you remember, but we did a concert at Arrival on Arrival, um, for Indian Arrival in Trinidad, mm -hmm. uh, called Arrival the Concert. Mm -hmm. And we raised a small amount of money, $45,000. Right? We gave ten thousand dollars to Sam Budram. We gave ten thousand dollars to Budram Holas, right? And there were a number of other artists that applied to us for grants. Right? And we gave all of those artists that applied to applied to us and we knew that they were in need a thousand dollars each. So we tried to spread that money as much as possible. And I would say this that whatever whatever donations come in right if we get more donations and the cost of the show we also have a foundation that is set up the south Tech foundation and we will continue to help artists but my motivation more than anything else for this year was making sure that we had a show that can give artists hope Alan. and that was my favorite four letter word for 2020 hope and if i can give artists and this industry hope then i would have achieved my goal for 2021 do you have do you have a, a word for 2021 so far as we're only 14 days into it right now? <laughs> <laughs> um I have a word here. Success. That's it's good. not a four letter word. But Chutney Soka Monarch will be a success. Well, that, we and it will probably be it will probably be one of you know when we started in 1996, and I've really gone over my time now, Alan, my apologies. <laughs> No, no, it's right. okay. You the main man. Everybody want to see you right now, you know. So when we started worry. in 1996, right? Mm -hmm. At the end of the competition, I received um, there, there was a there was a news report on TTT in those days, Trinidad and Tobago Television. And even though there were a lot of naysayers that said Chutney Soka Monarch had no place in Carnival, there was a report the night after Chutney Soka finals in Trinidad and Tobago in 1996 that said that Chutney Soka Mana was the greatest success of Carnival 1996 because it was something that was totally fresh, totally new, that came into the Carnival market and it just took the, the market by storm. In 2021, I want Chutney Soka Mana to be the greatest success of Carnival 2021. The non-carnival, the no carnival that we have it. I want Chutney Soka Monarch to stand out on the calendar. And I want people to refer to it as the greatest success of Carnival 2021. And I will be proud to have brought that to the table. And I, I will tip my hat to every artist, every producer, every dancer, Vashti, Reyes, Ranjeev, and everybody that has a part and you you too alan that play a role in keeping chutney soka alive the music the art form keeping those artists um songs playing on the radio giving them the hope that they want and let's hope that this pandemic goes away as quickly as possible and we could get back to those live shows where people can enjoy their favorite artists sip their 
their their their drinks and and wine and jump and whatever they want to do enjoy the music in front of live performances once again exactly now you know under the envy sounds banner third degree banner we have artists and 2020 their breaks got mashed and whatnot so we agree we want we're hoping that the pandemic takes a turn in regards to the numbers start going down live shows the borders open in trinidad these different kind of things so we wish you much success george because i know one of the things that you love is the fact that when your artists and them are able to travel and promote and you know we know we had i had gi on last week and he had mentioned that he, this year he won, but he felt unfortunate that he didn't really get to, you know, put out his title and defend his title and, and be out there and whatnot. What, what, what kind of words of encouragement you might have for GI and things like that for someone who's really suffered the most in regards to winning a prestigious title of Chutney Soka Monarch King of 2025 after 25 years, sorry, the 25th year, you know, feeling well, that kind of way. Yeah, you know, I'm... Um... I, it's it's really unfortunate that GI won the year when when things got um, shut down. But but I I, I want to say to GI that I think that he has to he has to keep the course that he's on. I think GI has a bright bright future ahead of him. Um, he's a young artist. I think there's a lot a lot in front of him um, that he keeps he needs to keep his eye on, and and th there's a bright future for him. This pandemic will go away, and when it goes away. Anna, Anna will still be a popular song mm -hmm. and people will still want to see G.I. He is a Chutney Soka Monarch, right? He is the Chutney Soka Monarch of 2020. He will always have that title. And who knows what will happen in 2021? He might come back and win again. He has to defend the title, right? right? But he will always have a title to his name. And it is something that he will carry with him for the rest of his life. I saw one of the comments here. Somebody said they have a question for George saying they want yeah. to know what grounds the judges will be judging the singers. That criteria is going to change slightly, Alan. We talked about it a little bit. Right. Mm -hmm. And I will make that criteria public. I have no problem in making the criteria public. Um, and the and the judges, um, what the judges will be looking at and the scores that they will be doing. And we will also make public um, what the percentage of votes will be um, so that people will know. But I mean, once those things come out, I would encourage people to vote for their favorite artists. And um, when the links come out for donations too, please help us. We need it. We need the help. The artists need the help. The industry needs the help. Okay, so as you guys heard, we lodge up our, our girl Shelly out of New York. Um, huge supporter of the culture, you know, always sharing the feed and things like that. Um, she's advocating to everyone, make sure and donate and things like that. So that, that's great. That's good feedback. So once George gets that information, as George knows, I'm a media outlet for Chutney Soka Monarch. I always put it out there and things like that. Thank you, Alan. Thank we, will, we will let everybody know how to donate. Every little bit helps. You understand? We know people are going through some tough times, but definitely in regards to... $10, whatever it is. You know, it right. So we're going to definitely... Put that out there we're gonna get all the voting information things like that and uh because i want to i want to reiterate the biggest challenge we have this year is really funding this particular show you know and raising sponsorship for it and i am keeping the stream free so don't get me wrong nobody has to pay to see the show in oala mm -hmm. and that's if great anybody wants to sit down in their living room and look at the show they can do that without donating we're not forcing people to donate I want people, I want as many people as possible to see Chutney Soka Monarch this year. But if in your heart you feel that you want to donate and help the artist and the art form and the show, feel free. Great. Now, um, I will have you back on before you before the finals and stuff like that. You know, we'll try to coordinate that depending on your schedule. What are your, your, your the biggest people that helps put out your music out there? What's let, the let, me just, let me just before, let me just big up Amit Gosai. I yeah. see Amit is online here with you. Yeah, I see. I was going to mention Amit, Amit from Canada. Canada. My friend, yeah. mm -hmm. uh, Amit was the guy that we worked with uh, for CSM Toronto. Right. Right. And we will continue to work with Amit. I know Vashti is representing CSM in Toronto, but Amit is a guy that we worked with. And we will continue to work with him and Vashti in Toronto. So Amit, top of the night to you. Happy New Year, my friend, my brother. Um, and I look forward to seeing you very soon. Now, Avinash, West Indian Chutney Music, huge Avinash, platform. Everybody here, boy. I've seen yeah. everybody here. Yeah. Well, you know, we nice. think is in everything. We like, we, that's, that's, that's just how it is. And, that's you good. Know, that's good. 
We want to lodge up one of the youngsters as making some Rishma Ramlau. You know, we, we always keep pushing females. The females come out fierce, and unfortunately, they haven't been able to cross that hurdle. And her son, who is a phenomenal writer, he's got two songs in. And, um, you know, Women Power. What's been the feedback so far in regards to, to women's um, submissions and things like that? Well, we have quite a few women in, uh, that, that have submitted songs this year. So we'll see We'll see what happens. We'll, we'll see when the names come out and, and we'll be able to tell how many women are there. Okay. But with regards to Reshma Ramnal's son, nice young man. Oh yeah, respectable. I love him to death. Um, he's, a, he's a very, very nice young, young guy and I think he will do um, well for Reshma um, in terms of, of her man. I know that he's now her new manager. So I wish them well. And, and Reshma is somebody that... that, that um, that, that I, I also love very much. Oh, I love all the artists in Ohio. <laughs> I love no, one of them. Yeah, you have to. Now, before even, the ones, even the ones that, that found me, you know? But you remember the year that Kenneth Superstar I was just gonna, me, I was just gonna say that. They pound you one year and they come back the next year and they're that hugging Kenneth you up. Superstar found me and the man went all over and tell me all kind of things. He cussed me all over. But I love Kenneth Superstar. He's and a great as a matter of fact, just before I started this interview, Kenneth called me tonight. You know, so so we talk all the time, right? Oh, that, that's Kenneth great. is a man who will call you at 10 o'clock in the night and sing a song for you and ask you what you think before he, he goes to the studio. He's viral right now. He did a, him and him and uh, uh, what do you call it? Wiz did a, they did a Facebook live and Kenneth is all over. People are using him on yeah, TikTok, yeah. all this kind of stuff. Yes, is yes, crazy. Yes, yes. Yeah, so is before I let you go, George, what yeah. is the avenues that people are going to need to use to watch CSM? 26. Okay, so it's, it's going to be, I mean, I, I don't want to give you all the avenue, right? It's going to be YouTube, Facebook, um, CNC Trees feed on Facebook. It's going to have several feeds. Okay. I will be sure to post all the feeds where you'll be able to see it. Mm -hmm. um, so you'll be able to see it on CNC Tree stream. If you're in Trinidad and Tobago, you'll be able to watch it live on CNC Tree. You'll also be able to see it on all our pages on Facebook, on our channels on YouTube. But I will post all the links for people to be able to see it and, and for them to know well in advance. The semi-finals, as I said, will be broken into two segments, right? And the final will be one segment. Semi-final will be either the 30th and the 1st or the 29th and the 30th. And the final will be on the 30th. Okay, great. Now, I got a lot of your artists, a lot of the artists in them are on the inside right now. Anthony Batson, we got uh, Dr. Tunes, we got uh, Sandy. It's, I, I, it's a lot Sandy. to go through. There's a lot to go through in regards to the artists, but um, I brought on a lot of artists. I still have, I interviewed 12 artists so far. I got right. another 12 within the next couple of weeks and things like that. So message yeah. me, we'll get you on and things like that. We yeah, wish I see you. Anthony Bats is here. Yeah, Hi, Mr. Anthony. Curry, yep. He, one of the... Anthony, Anthony... I've yeah, seen Anthony Batson. Yeah, that's him. That's Mr. Bihari himself, Mr. Anthony Batson. Right, right, right. Yeah, that, yeah. Mr. Bihari, yeah. That's his song for this year. So, right. yeah. anything, those artists in them that are locked in right now, any words of encouragement you want to give them? Well, um, let's see what happens on Sunday. Let's see who are the mm -hmm. people are in the semifinal. I think everybody has done an amazing job. I want to congratulate everybody that did their submissions because I know that before we had the first meeting, people were very doubtful whether any shows would happen, whether Chutney Soka Monarch would happen. And I think it's only after we had the first and maybe the second meeting that people realized how serious I was um, and that the show was definitely happening. And that's when, that's when people um, started going back into the studios to produce their music and we mm -hmm. saw music coming out um, very quickly after that. No, well, and I was gonna, I was gonna mention that we got kind of digressed. When you made the announcement, prior to the announcement, songs was just trickling, da 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 da, because everyone yeah. was like, "What's the point?" You know. And yeah. now, when CSM twenty six, what George is actually gonna do it? Here's what, boom, boom, yeah. boom, boom, boom. Yeah. And we know that's one of the other reasons for the extension because yes. Maha and Rich and everybody has been under the yeah. gun to the fifteenth yeah. and stuff yeah. like that. And the thing is, I chat with those producers all the time. Right. Um, so I'm, I'm in touch with them, so I know I know who they have in studio, I know what they're working on. Um, if somebody is running late, they usually message me or call me, the producers themselves, mm -hmm. and say, George, I have so-and-so in studio, you know, give him a, give, give us some time. So, I mean, I try to work with everybody, because at the end of the day, you want to get all the music in uh, um, as possible, uh, as you know, so... 
Okay. Well, George, I know you got to go, and uh, I know we went a little bit over, but I know you have your next meeting and stuff. Thank you very much, sir, for taking that, the time. Thanks very much, Alan. Thanks very much for having me, and, and congratulations on on doing your 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 thing. My your thing. thing. Which well, is it's, not, it's not my thing and it's not your thing. It's, it's we thing. So, oh, <laughs> so George, once again, thank you again. Uh, like I said, we're going to try and link up again, coming closer to the finals and stuff like that. And uh, we're going to let everybody know all the information that they need to know. All right. Thank you very much, Alan. All right. All right. All right. I'm wishing everybody the best for the new all, year. All the best for the new year. And to your 2021 word of the year, success. I wish you lots of it, brother. Success. To you and every participant Everyone. of... Chutney Soka Monarch 26, right? Yep. So that was Mr. George Singh. Sandish! Holland in the building, George! So I'm gonna let... I'm gonna let George go. Have a good night, brother. So you guys heard it. Lots of inside information. Thank you all the time to the man himself, Mr. George Singh, the CEO of Southex. 26 years, Shani Soka Monarch. I'm loving that word. I'm loving that word of the year. Loving that word of the year. So if each and every one of us join together, if we're abroad, then we make a little donation and thing. Sitar Amatinel! Good night, good night, good night. Good night going out to my brother, Mr. Ahmed Sagram. He's going to be on Saturday. Mamu! Large up, powerhouse. You just missed the interview. You still have chance to enter, Mamu. Hey, hey, Batson. Can I go now to Nishal B? So you all make sure. To all the artists in them that's locked in, make sure and WhatsApp me. We'll get you on the air. Eh, 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 eh. Large up. Yankee boy.
So everybody make sure, make sure, make sure, make sure, like the page. Good night, Miss Shakira Marcus. Hey, hey, Nick, you see your boy Dave says, Envy Sound. So large, my brother Dave. Next week, I should be seeing you. Oh, Lord, oh, Lord. So everybody, make sure and stay locked in. Share the feed. Make sure and like the page so you know about the notifications. Nick, if you only see right now. Now hear what, now hear what. I was just messaging George back. He says, thank you. He can't wait to get out the information to each and every one of you. And thank him very much for taking the time. I know, I know, I know. He got a little bit busy there. We had another meeting to go to. Tonight going on to Rhonda. Sitra Mati Radha. Uncle Roy. Rhonda, make sure and go in the feed itself and not the watch party, right? So that's right, we got a lot of info there. We got a next soca, a soca artist coming up just now. But here what? I see it. I see it. People want to hear Mr. Bihari. Well, then tell me what tune you want to hear. What tune you want to hear? Bring the bottle. Bring the spoon. Bring the bottle. And you ride her. Bring the bottle. Bring the spoon. Knock a table and bust a tune. We in a Ghana session. The bottle and spoon in the hand. Playing with favorite jam. Knock a thing. Knock a thing. Singing. You know what I was singing? This might 
talk, want to come in between me and mash up me and my family. This I talk, want to come in between me and mash up me and my family. But sometimes it is feel to take a thing. It does make me feel to dance and to sing. But my family do want me to take a drink. This I do. Want to come in between me and mash up me and my family? So hear what, so hear what. Oh, I'm bringing it back, I'm bringing it back. Anti Rada says hi to Mohan, Tara, and Rian. Also to my sister Tara, brother in law, Mohan, and niece Rian in Trinidad. Lodge up Trinidad on the inside. So, as you all heard, Chani Soka Monarch is happening. More info soon to come. Hey, look, this song, one of these songwriters for the tune. Vishan, what you say? What you say? What you say? Mr. Bihari want me marry his daughter. He take me to a party so I could get to know her. Mr. Bihari want me marry his daughter. He take me to a party so I could get to know her.
Good video.
Captain Peas and Spanish Rice. And a glass of more, we were six more times, so we had to play it twice. Really, my man. So Cindy says, Good night to myself and Amelia. She want to hail out on Karai and Auntie Radha. Rhea and Rhonda and the family. You know i wicked. I'm always wicked, darling. You don't need anybody to dance. You know how you just go down. Hafiza. If you guys like the fan page, you get the notification as soon as one. That's what for Rhea. Drop some soccer for your dad. Don't go to it. Hard work Sunday to Sunday. No ways we time to party. Let we come together. Bring a bottle and bring your crew. This thing long overdue. It's only one thing left to do. Vision! Let we chunk it up. Go to the corridor. Good night going out to my Joyce family. You missed the interview with George Singh. So larger Pradeep, Dave, and everybody's second mom. But these boys first mom. Auntie Sheila and our Joyce family. Respect going out to Joyce each and every time. With their food drive and everything. Don't worry now. We got you, we got you. I gotta come and check you out, Dave. I come in, I come in, I come in. I come in. I know you you love to put the chutney on the food. Sunday to Sunday, no ways we time to party. Let we come together. Bring a bottle and bring your crew. This thing long overdue. It's only one thing left to do.
Don't worry about this intro. All I wanted was a bling. No, she wanted a wedding ring. She ready to run away. Don't care what she husband So Cindy says goodnight to my mom. Not the girl. She looking for the boy. She fired the city. Go and make me the boss. Holy head and body. Holy head and body. Christian. So I tell you Saturday. Saturday. Don't forget, don't forget. All you like the page. Because Saturday, we're going to have Mr. Stargram. Ahmed Stargram. The song star. Sangeeta. And the fire woman herself. That's right, the fire woman. Rose up the corn. Nisha Ramsuk. So I tell you, rock is on the wings. Brand new soak artist. I tell you, I tell you, I tell you. Hey, hey, Ahmed, you hear the thing? So we got brand new soccer artists coming up in just a few. His name is Rock. Rock, make sure, make sure we get Razor on, the, on, the, on this here, you know. Send him the link, tell him log in. Sherian. Question, yeah. Play some soak over Sherry on here. Get shitty vibes now. When you see that block boy tonight, what you gotta do? What you gotta do?
Hey, what shall we? Long time you don't know I want it. I love your habit. Long time you don't know. She gonna look at Prime. For your doing it. Back it up right there, girl. Bring it. Bring that for me. Can I go to the call list here? I'm gonna find out. Oh, I think you're talking about Raymond's song. Oh, Kumar, Mr. Nice Vibes. I got you, I got you. So, Nick, now I gotta play this song for Jenny. Jenny! for a girl. Well, Prem, you're not going to get no Prem tonight. Dave! How we moving? How we moving? For 2021, Dave. We think uh, we are a couple weeks away from our six-year anniversary. Now hear what? Now hear what? Montreal! 
Rashida. You can hear the background noise. Who bring another man in just a couple? Roger Marlin. That's on the YouTube. We're going to climax and miss the interview, boy. Andy Sham, I'm going to get you in just a few. So good night, good night, good night. night Going night. out to each and every one of you. So I'm bringing on the line, bringing on the air. First time to the Weeting family. But my brother Razor is not new to the family. So of all you guys know, we sponsor me, somebody sponsor me, singer. Razor of the Request Band, long time family of Weeting. And our girl, gorgeous Leon's. Now, we, me and Razor was talking, Soka Monarch, no Soka Monarch this year. Music kind of a bit on a hold. But he said, Al, I got this artist. Just came out with a new track. He's kind of um, taking him by the wings and kind of helped directing him and stuff like that. And you couldn't be joined with a, a, a more humble, more professional brother, our boy Razor. I'd like to welcome on air. The man known as Rock. Good night, brother. How you doing? How you feeling? How's night, it night. All right, right, right. Everything cool. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. So, Rock, here's what. Lower your camera just a little bit. But um, tell everybody a little bit about yourself and, uh, you know, who is Rock? Um, simple for that from Sunny Grandy. Grandy? Not as my name. Huh? That's a Grandy in the building. Yes, sir. <laughs> you know? Darren Moore is my name. Go by the name of Rock. Everybody knows my Rock, you know. Now, how did you get about into the singing and so forth? Uh, you know, and you do well, a, a, a soca. Well, I always like it singing from way back, you know. And then, sure, my brother ended up meeting some some others, you know, from the industry. Going to them, going with them them to studios, lying with them, mm -hmm. and then actually met Razor. So, you hear me there? Yeah, you, you're kind of buffering in and out a little bit. Uh, hopefully oh. you're not on a phone, but... Um... No, no, I need the laptop. Okay, so make sure nothing else is running in the background. That could that could probably be it. But, um, so you, you, yes. you're linked up with Razor. How, how, yeah. how did... The, and who so was Razor in charge of spearheading this project or was it something that uh, you was uh, doing it's actually something i went to him like one night i texted him i like boy i will write a track for my boy you see all right you know after that the morning the morning after i think he called me say boy, rock boy i dream you know, i had a dream you know <laughs> okay yeah serious no kicks. He said, I had a dream. Come and check, man. I said, all right, I'll come and check you. Went and check him. He sang a, a piece in the voice to me. i like, you know what, boy? This will work in it. He said, all right, check me tomorrow. 
call up the producer and everything. That's just Lionel production. Big up to Lionel. And um from that we end up we end up going to the studio, you know, record the song. Now, this is recorded in New York. Um Yeah, in New York. Okay, so recorded, recorded in New, New York. York. Yeah. Now who is some of your icons in, in soca that that made you want to follow down this path? Because singing is not easy, you know, and uh, following such a, a, a hard market, let's say, because as you know, abroad, Razor could tell you, we have men like Lyrical and Yankee and them and Razor who've, right. who've uh, made that mark in regards to the overseas. And now you being a, a new youngster and in this COVID time, it's not going to be kind of easy you know, but uh, who's giving you that motivation to say this is something that I wanted to do? Actually, honestly speaking, I would say that is one of them, you know. I listen to a lot of artists, a lot of them, you know, but like Reza is one of them. His work ethic is phenomenal. I, I, I know that firsthand. Mm -hmm. You know, he's a cool person, like personally a cool cool person he'll show you things that people other people wouldn't show you like he actually put me sit and actually show me the business aspect of it and not only that how to love the art you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. so yeah. are you a co-writer are you interested in writing um you know or yeah. are you working yeah. with anyone that's out like there? i just do my little stuff i just do my little stuff mm -hmm. now who like i said who's um Besides Razor, who is some of your icons in, in this soccer industry? I mean, I just listen to everybody. I have no one special. Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, you got you got some comments on the side there. I, I believe there's a, some of your family people is larging up. There was... Um, this there's an emily mohan that's locked in you know large of your peoples and them and, and stuff like hey, that no no big up yourself family no no nigel dave shelly marlon <laughs> everybody right, there's a, there's a Marlin Marlin that was locked in now i know we got shelly uh sherry ann that's out of georgia sherry you're from georgia right she says welcome rock big up to you we got no, uh, no. <laughs> got a missy ray that's giving you a lot of flames and stuff like that the song's been out nice, for just nice. over a week or so what's the feedback been and have um i know ray's is trying to help you out in, in trinidad and things like that what's been yeah. uh, the response i mean it's nice like people 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 really, people really like any song you know it's nice people, i got a lot of feedback from people saying you know nice and really, so really, really nice you know so i mean all in all it's good so far you know mm -hmm. Now, what has been some of the challenges you're facing now in regards to being a new artist coming out onto the scene here? Especially honestly, COVID time and you know, what's some of that? Honestly, I would say I'm facing none at this time. Good. That's great. Yeah, none. All right. So we got um, a Joe just large you up. Thing like that. They so, got so, <laughs> so here's Respect. what give give everybody a little bit of background about the song is called all of that so let's give everybody a little background about the song i mean basically it's actually it's something like you know sometimes you're going, you're going down the road or you're passing down the road and you see a nice little song you know them young fellas like oh you are all of that girl, you know? <laughs> so it's, it's actually based on that concept okay okay nice you nice know? nice and you yeah. well from you're from new york so i could only imagine all the <laughs> out there. we know we know how that goes down yep yep <laughs> so you know okay so now rock since you're, you're new to the scene and things like that how can people follow you in regards to what's rock doing larger my brother imran Ahmad out of um out of uh, new york one of our bright youngsters out well he's 12 years in the business but you know does a lot yeah. of events i'm gonna link you up with imran imran's a very good humble guy now cool, cool. you know how can how can they find rock if they want to find out rock's music his progression you know what's the best way to find him well you can find me at on um facebook at darren Mohan. that is d-r-y-l-m-o-h-a-n and on Instagram at Das Rock Mohan, that's D A A S R O C K M O H A N at Mohan. Now, 
With the name Rock, does anybody get you kind of tie up with Dwayne Johnson? I see you kind of... No, no, no. I ain't have a lot of ties. No, no, no. No tying up with that. Huh? All right. No, yeah. problem, no problem. No problem. No problem. Um, <laughs> what do you call it? One more thing that I wanted to tell you. And I, I lost my... Busy trying to harass you. And I lost my train of thought. Oh, but um, <laughs> you got you got your peoples in them that's, that's locked in and stuff. Oh, any video? You gonna Are you thinking about doing a video? A lot of people, you know, work on... I know Razor and Leon's and them is they they love the video and things yeah 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 <laughs> i actually um did a um cartoon version really yeah uh upload, cool. i uploaded it but it was a little too graphic so we kind of working on it right now probably this week i will um put it up okay good so well, it also goes to, um i said wish you luck in that that's good man yeah yeah the yep. videos, is, the videos is the thing the videos is yep. the thing so before i let you go like we said we, we we know how to find you and stuff like that what is it that uh you any any people you want to large up anybody you want to um big up and stuff out there anything like that i mean big up there is uh joe locked in everyone locked in you know big up to them mr marlon you know big up the animal production same time you know lion and so big up everybody you know who locked on who know me there you go. So like I said, I'm going to link you, you up to my dad and them watching me in the back too. <laughs> your dad and them is in New York or they're back home? New York, New York. New York. All right. So large up, large up the Mohan family. So like I said, my boy Imran says he want to hear what the rock is singing. We got to Imran. <laughs> all right. There we go. There we go. So we're going to, we're going to bust this tune just now. Anything else you want to say, brother, before we, we bust this thing? All right. Go follow me, you know. All the fans, right. go follow me. And follow, follow the music, you know. Enjoy the night. Hope everyone has TF here and beast this year. We all the masks too. All right. <laughs> Don't know. So here's what. Rock, you do the official release and we bust in this tune, brother. All right. So go ahead and large up your track and I'm going to drop it. Okay. Well, well. This is all I got from me one and only. You rock. Don't know. And the chat, baby. I'm 
Hey, hey, so all of that, so I'm going to let Rock go. Rock, we wish you all the best, brother. Positive down, feedback down, so down. far. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. You guys will be hearing more from The Rock. <laughs> Respect, brother. All the best to you and the family. Large yeah, Razor and crew. <laughs> Imran, I'm going to send you his number and vice versa. Weeting family. Let me see some flames for the man now. All of that. Respect, brother. Imran, Imran, Imran. She turned on to my mom. So everybody, make sure to like the fan page. If you're new to the family, hey what? Hey what? Hey what? I like in that song rock. I like in the tune rock. Hear what? When I go out to Pamela. I feel it so fast. I feel it so party. I feel like a drink. Some rum from the morning. Trevor. Hope we have some more thing coming out from the young man. Don't go nowhere, Emran. Don't go nowhere.
Lord of Ravi. Q is you. I am the king. I am the monk. Hear what? Hear what? Island Zone. Imran. Hear what, hear what? Just for Imran. Oh my baby, come and lie with me in for a yesterday. We go in a dark. Hell yeah. This is sugar daddy. Aya. There's only one place to win. Hora Ripper. Oh my baby, come and lie with me in for a. Oh my baby, come and lie with me in for a yesterday. Hey, what? Or maybe Saturday, Shelly. If she only bring the roti, hey, hey, hey. my boy would have been okay. No divorce. Hey, hey. No divorce and run.
really hope. I really hope this didn't happen to you. Vasti, you miss it. Launch my sister Vasti Durga. We're not going on to Dante. But Imran. This one Imran singing right now, you know. Vasti! You done hooked me already. Could it be your cute pretty face? Could it be the oil in your waist? Make me feel like a hotter chase. You hooked me already. Girl, you're smart, you know how to spend Where you take care of the children This shit never end But if you want me to go You can be looking the way you do You can be cooking the way you do You can be hooking me If you want me to go You can be looking the way you do You can be walking the way you do Because you're hooking me Come on! I don't know what to do, so I'm pleading Plus you ain't give me no reason Tell me this is the end of the season Mash up we think just just so But you don't understand when you watch me I said I see that I win the lunch you know How you go pick up just so and then dump me No baby no But your back on me clothes in a garbage bag You put it on the ground by the roadside You tell me get out your place to come inside Baby don't do me that you go break me heart Can't believe you're ready to give up on me just so Oh the neighbor You want me to go you can be looking the way you do You can be cooking the way you do You can be hooking me If you want me to go You can be looking the way you do You can be walking the way you do Because you're hooking me uh. Oh lad, oh lad Imran! Lad. Imran! Turn up the mic Eh, eh, eh Hear hey, what Imran? Can I say I fed up with heart All your feelings broke I'm making I don't want to hit on love But sometimes I keep me beating hey, what? She say she only lover She only friend We make a wish I get prepared I sleep and I had a dream Wake up and I make a vow Good boy Soon as everything comes to we saw What we say? What I do wrong again, lad Tell me what I do wrong again People calling me them, lad Imran, 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 hey what? Turn up the mic, eh, eh, eh. When I say I'm fed up with heart, all your feelings broke I'm making. I don't want to hit on love, but sometimes I keep me busy. 
Unity. She say she only lover, she only friend. We make a wish, I we prepare. I sleep and I had a dream. Wake up and I make a vow. Soon as everything comes to we saw one all. What I do wrong again, lad? Tell me what I do wrong again. But Imran, it's not only your fault, boy. It's not only your fault. <laughs> Always fully clothed, not a thing exposed when she home with me. When she leave the house, everything come out and gone on display. Now she coming out in short thing, leave it bam bam showing. Don't wink, she exposing me. Nothing she concealing, everything revealing. Let to see that she's out there. Plenty girl of mine. I can like this. Well, you see, Imran, it's all your fault, you know. It's your fault, Imran. You know why? <laughs> 12 years in the business on TV and thing. You know what? But you know what, Emma? You know what? I better go. You know, it wasn't too much trouble. It's not the first, not the last. So, so much pretty girl I pass, and holding out is such a task. That's why me I say this from my heart. Oh Lord, don't let me cheat on my girlfriend. Cause as far as I can see, she loves only me. Oh Lord, don't let me cheat on my girlfriend. But Lord, if you can stop me from cheating, just don't let me get caught. Don't get caught. No. Don't let me get caught. No. Don't let me get caught. No. 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 Good night, hey. Hafiza. Hot. Saturday at two. And now it's such a sticky situation. Yeah. I promise my girl, if you only look in her direction, but everywhere me turn, me see her next one. Yeah. I'm a body here too weak and I'm bad. You know, you know. I only wanna give the girls what they. My lady says I'm wrong, but she would understand. I don't wanna lie, but I don't want to pay you. I'm so very My brother is she. Oh, love, don't let me cheat on my girlfriend. Cause as far as I can see, she loves only me. Oh, love, don't let me cheat on my girlfriend. She is the one who cheats. But, Lord, if you can stop me from cheating, just don't let me. But, ladies. Some boy I go ball Cause I remix your heart Keep doing what you want But I hope you don't mix when we start Lord, I don't wanna cheat on my boyfriend But as far as I can see He's cheating on me Lord, I don't wanna cheat on my boyfriend But a lot since you can't stop him from cheating Wait till him left the yard Is our next man a come in yard Just wait till him left the yard I want them boy I take me far I want them <laughs> Listen to the situation Me have my man but him a cheat with the next girl Him swear upon the cross say I me one Him no know say so me know but I got the information Oh why should I stay home and cry You take me for fool while I'm faithful to you and next Girl, you are do while I'm waiting for you Or if you do that, oh, you're too damn rude Lord, I don't want to cheat on my boyfriend But as far as I can see 
Follow the page if you're new. I'll be back Saturday at 2. Dos! Thank you again. You hear what, Imran? Song for us. Reshma! Mohini? Trying to get your peoples on. But hear what, hear what? One thing. I can say I see boys, 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 and them girls. You know what, you know what? Every day I have to pray she put the quarrel today. One more song for Imran before I go.
Remember, like the page. Saturday, I'm in Sagra. Saturday, Sangeeta, Anisha Ramsuk. Where we GT family there? Why not swing she ways? All the ladies joining she Lately, I've been having so much problem And I don't know how to solve them Since I found you, I'm happy And you bring my whole life around Always there when I'm feeling down Since I found you, I'm happy Even Abu, but before I go, you don't know what you have. On the so good night. Let's go. Good night, my waiting family. You don't know what you have. On the let's go. Now you're up and gone away, baby. Didn't wanna stay, baby. I wasn't the play, baby. I just want your hair, baby. Where you really want me to? Should I know my love for you is true? Can you been? Can you been tell me that you're never gonna leave? And I want it all. Can you been tell me that you're never gonna leave? Can you been tell me one more weekday? gonna leave. The girl birthday next week. You been tell me that Christina. You see, you should have given US dollar. Good night to my brother, Mr. Imran Ahmad. Congratulations on 12 years promoting culture, promoting unity, promoting us. When you listen to the lights and they feeling you inside, they don't believe. They go try everything to make we unhappy. When you listen to the lights and they feeling you inside, they don't believe. They go try everything. Shelly, yeah. fool you. Say nine to you, right? Got up of sixteen tomorrow, no. sixteen. Ooh, tell you been, tell you been, tell me that you never gonna leave. Tell you been, tell me that you never gonna leave. Oh, hi, 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 this is Nikki Crosby, and it's We Ting Radio. I mean, hello, it's We Ting, so I have to be in it. We Ting Radio. Boom.